Good morning. I wanted to share a quick video with you on how myself and many people are using Google Earth for historical analysis of properties. So first I'm going to turn on the Dell Valley land grant and we're going to zoom in on that because that's the area of focus. Of course the Collins Farm is on or part of the Dell Valley land grant. You can see Bergstrom Air Force or the International Airport here in this view, Pilot Knobs down in this area. So now we're going to turn that off and I'm going to turn on the outline of the Collins track I shared with you yesterday. Zoom in on that. Now if I roll the horizon so we're in direct overhead view of it, that pretty much looks like what we saw yesterday. Now if I roll it all the way down flat, you'll also see that in this perspective, it looks like a flat plane, which we know is not true. Pilot knobs of uh, one of the, the highest point in that area. So I can turn on and exaggerate terrain. And now you can see pilot knob. You can see this basin through which Cottonmouth Creek goes. If we crawl over to this other side, the north side of the track, and scroll back around where we're looking southwest back at it, now you can see this, this ridge or rim, as Ernie described it, which is, delineates the watershed of Onion Creek on the north side and Cottonmouth Creek on, this, on the uh, south side. And you can see that basin through which Cottonmouth runs between Pilot Knob and this rim. So now I'm going to go back to the perspective we were at. I'm going to zoom out, flatten this back out. So this is flying over it in the 21st century. How about we re rewind the clock and turn on some 1940 aerial images and now you get the chance to fly over the property as it looked in 1940. Let's roll these perspectives around. You can see here, it's really easier to see that uh, elevation changes with the aerial images turned on. So here's Onion Creek. We go across the rim and this nice beautiful valley in which the Collins settled. So some reference points here. Here is uh, Cottonmouth School Road, D. Gabriel Collins Road, of course the Collins cemeteries in this area. So I thought you might like to see what that would have looked like if you flew over it in 1940. All these beautiful cultivated fields. I'm not sure if these dots are orchard or it could be haystacks. You can see some houses and structures scattered through here. Anyway, thought you'd like to see that. Have a great day.